Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, or if you're new, thanks for stopping by. Got my coffee, we're ready to make some beats. I've been using Ableton a lot and have been trying to figure out what role Reason has in my workflow because I'm I'm not ready to break up with Reason completely yet, I don't think. But I I just I'm not sure what to use it for now. It's got like a bunch of sounds that I really like and some really creative instruments. So I'm thinking maybe Reason's more like a scratch pad, like something I can use to generate ideas that I can then go and manipulate and play with in Ableton. So what the plan is today is to spend like an hour and come up with four loop ideas, like kind of sounds, generate some stuff, some sound design that I can then drag into Ableton later and make some fully fledged tracks out of. So, uh, yeah, an hour, like 15 minutes of loop or whatever. I've got some sounds that I just dragged in to start with. I don't know what they are, some instruments, but we'll, uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll get going and we'll um, hopefully <laughs> come up with some good, some good vibes. Need some more coffee. I don't even know if this is an instrument. No, I don't want to play with that. We'll, we'll go, we'll throw in Reason's new bass synthesis there. Synthesizer. My gosh. Alright, let's double this up. Let's duplicate that channel and we'll go and put one of the original piano sounds on it. That might do the job. Alrighty, safe. Um, <clears throat> this is sketch one. We're running a little behind schedule. What should we call it? Let's call it behind schedule. Okay, file, new. All right, for the second one, um, let's start, let's do something, let's do a different vibe. Let's do, uh, I haven't, I haven't really used this. This is called Housewife. Let's just start with this. I don't know what this is. Okay. Okay, there we go. What if we use an Octorex as the bass? Hello, okay. All right, this is a vibe. I'm enjoying this. Yes. All right, now I need some kind of like melodic top line for that. Um, yeah, let's go grain. Grain's inspiring me. What are we gonna get though? Man, 
maybe. Nah, this gross. Last night, not so good. Oh, okay. What should we call this one? Uh, how about deep fried sushi? Because one of those patches had sushi in the name. And I feel like fried chicken. Mmm. That's a cool chord. That's just a G. I'm inspired. Alright. Uh, let's do some more volume. Trying some, some different notes so we have some more stuff to work with. Well, uh, I feel like this one is the most chaotic of all of them. I don't even know if I'm playing in the same key, but you know, I think there's some interesting information there. So we'll make that fit. We'll call that one. Uh, what should we call that one? That was cold. We'll call that one cold coffee. Change those drums. Guys, this is a vibe. Twilight Snowmen. I don't know, I just I just feel like this one kind of sounds like... I feel like this one kind of sounds like some snowmen marching kind of at night. Like, I don't know. T Twilight Snowmen. Anyway, we've done it. Four sketches in about an hour. I'm, uh, I'm well aware that some of these sound pretty trash right now. But I'm listening for like interesting sounds and parts. What I'm going to do next is bounce these down to audio, different stems and audio, and then drag them into Ableton and then start working with the audio like that. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of in, I'm, I'm, like, I'm looking forward to seeing how these are going to turn out. I have no idea. So hopefully they will be good. But if you want to see what they look like, subscribe to the channel. Give this video a like. I'm going to be working with one or two of them in Ableton hopefully sometime soon so you'll get to see what they sound like. Uh, yeah. I'm going to go drink more coffee because that last sip was cold. You can't be having, can't be having cold coffee. Twilight, Twilight Snowmen would probably drink cold coffee.